Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Pretty Girl Saves and my name is Nay and on this channel we do saving challenges, mini challenges, unboxings, and show lots of pretty things. Today we are going to do an unboxing, two unboxings actually, and we're going to do saving challenges and reallocate some money. Um, so yes friends, I am super excited and let's go ahead and get into it. Hey friends, I'm going to input this at the beginning of the video because I just wanted to stop and take a moment to thank you guys for 500 um, besties. We're over halfway now to 600. So I just really appreciate you guys and your support and your friendship. And I am super, super excited. So as a thank you, I did, um, if you guys read my community post, I did put up a bunch of different freebies. They are all Monsters Inc. themed. So I'm super, super excited for it and i've been really really that was like one of my favorite movies when i was growing up that's why i wanted to do like my 500 dedicated to monsters inc and i think it'll be cute like going into like um halloween and fall and yeah friends so cute little monsters challenge um i don't have them all printed out but i do have one or i think yeah i have one of them i can show you guys at least and it was the one I did want to explain. Okay, so this is one of them. Um, and we will be starting this one in our savings challenge video, which um, I will be recording next. But this one's Mike's Scare Final Countdown. And it's basically just a calendar. Um, on the one that you guys will get, it does have like a little instruction. Not instructions, but just kind of directions, I guess, here. Just with one sentence. But you could just treat this as a calendar. And you would just cross out... Um, like in the movie when he was crossing out the days down into the scare final. So it's just essentially the same thing. Crossing out each square could be $2. Um, and then the, for the event of first day, um, you can the, you can dedicate an amount for that. Or you could just do $2 for the entire thing. I thought it would be fun to do $2 plus if, if events were $3. And this square would be $5. Then two, 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 five. It is up to you. I think how I'm going to play it is I'm going to roll the dice because you guys know I love roll and saves and treat this as a roll and save plus whatever the events add. But yeah, I like this one because it's super, super cute. It's a, definitely a nod to the movie um, where he was just crossing out on his calendar and I added some cute little events and things for the scare final and then for the scare games. Um, and this is obviously based off of Monsters, Inc. 2 University. And yeah, I'm super, super excited for this one. So that's how this one is played. And it, this was one of the freebies. Um, and then this is another digital download um, in my Ko-Fi shop that I did put up, friends. And I, we will be starting my saving challenges. Um, and this is basically just kind of like a versus bracket. Um, and we're going to be... Um, doing this one together so I'm really excited to start these two challenges and then there is more um, Monsters Inc freebies in my Google Drive for the 500 um, milestones so go check out my Google Drive friends go check out my Ko-Fi shop for the versus bracket if you do like that one or my other challenges that are for sale so yeah thank you guys for all of your support and on to 600 yay all right friends so we do got one package today the other one was actually for Timu, so i'm gonna throw it into a Timu video i got two ginormous bags from Timu, so that's gonna have to be its whole video so yeah so we do have one package to open today so i'm really excited let's go, let's go ahead and open it up I like that it said do not bend on the front. What is this? <gasps> Ooh. Oh my god. Oh, I love this. Okay. This is from A and E Budgets. I've been wanting to. This is so cute. Oh my god, I've been collecting these. Hold on. Sorry guys, I'm struggling. This is such cute. If I can get my life together, this is such a cute package. Oh my god. I love how creative this is. Okay, so oh, it's me forever. Thank you for your order. It's oh my god, what is her name? But it's a new princess from Wish, and her Etsy is La Mason Salvigen. So, Not for sure, sorry. And then YouTube and Instagram at AE Budgets. 
that is so cute that's gonna have to go in our pouch sorry for the shake because you guys know i have been collecting those and that's gonna be a scratch off challenge can we get enough but i love this it's just like a big little bag oh my gosh okay guys i'm so excited wow so i ordered a bunch of different things from her i guess we'll start with the this um she has so many cute challenges friends like it's one of my new favorite shops um so this is a grinch board game um obviously you guys know i love board games and <laughs> this one's just so cute the things that it says oh, four o'clock wallow in self-pity that is me <laughs> so yeah came with a cute dashboard i believe that they had mean one sorry i believe that there was the option for a five and a six and i chose a five i like that this little stocking says cindy lou that is so cute and then it does come with this green dice and a little game piece so 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 cute i love this so that i've been i need it not I always say I needed this, but I've been wanting some new Christmas challenges. Um, I feel like I'm good on Halloween challenges for right now. And now I'm going to start looking for Christmas challenges. So the next thing I got was she has lots of different like card challenges. I love these little pink bags as well. Um, and this is um, some villains. Just like little scratch offs for villains. And I thought when we finish one for our mini scratch offs this will be cute to add in just a little card so got those card sets i got a couple so i got this um monsters ink of course and then i got a grinch christmas one and it has two so <laughs> so excited so that's what those ones are i got this spongebob pack as well i just love every single challenge that they had it was so hard to pick but this was the spongebob pack here's a save 35 i love this one with the balloon <laughs> oh my god this is a save 45 this is so cute oh my gosh um this one is a surprise amount this one's a save 25 and we got patrick with a save 35 i love these these are so pretty and the colors oh my god so that was this one and then the other one is do i even have to tear those i don't even have to tear it oh my god friends okay let's see maybe i do okay well i did i might have to cut this bag a little bit Okay, okay. and yeah i've been wanting some new scratch offs got another one of those things we'll add that in oh my gosh two stickers these are beautiful little air hot air balloons those are beautiful um looks like we got some mini freebies oh my god these are so cute it's got a micro and a mini living you guys know i just started that micro binder oh my gosh guys so cute and then i did get these um disney ones so we have the little two little mice from cinderella it says have courage and be kind like that was so sweet it's a save 45. this one it says if the shoe fits and it's a save 60. we have tarzan oh so here is the same 55 i love the colors in this one we have um from encanto the whole crew um it's a safe 50 i thought this one was so beautiful and this one these ones are the little um pelicans and they're like mine 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 from nemo so cute i believe i these were all like separate listings on her shop and i picked out these ones and yeah so I don't I feel like these two might have came together I'm not totally for sure she has lots of different options on her shop so go check her out on Etsy friends there's a lot of if you love Disney um 
or like the style um she has a lot of different options on there and oh, i'm so in love with everything i do kind of want to add two of these into our minis because i i um our mini scratch off book because friends i did um get to the we did you know go through the whole book and i realized i don't have two challenges so not for sure so let's go ahead and add in we'll put these cards we'll do one set of cards and then that's perfect and then there's a front pocket too maybe we'll do hmm. oh, i love all of them <laughs> Uh, kind of want to do a Spongebob one, but does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, because this is the ocean, right? Okay, we'll do Patrick. Okay, I try to like just do random so I'm not picking out things forever. Okay, I just grabbed one and then that's what I went with. So, yeah, friends, again, now it's from A and A E Budgets. So cute. I'm going to get this cleaned up and we'll get um, into our saving challenges. All right, friends, we are back. So here we go. So let's go ahead and get into a nice money count. Um, I cannot find my other quick sort. I think my daughter took it. It's okay, because we have this one. Okay, let's get into a quick money count. I'm gonna get the calculator out for visual purposes. Okay, so we have 20, 40, 60, 81. 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 110, for 510, oops, sorry, okay, and we have 510, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. For three, five hundred and thirty-two dollars to stuff today. We are going to um, stuff a little bit in sinking funds. Um, and we are going to stuff for um, our cash wallet for next week. So yeah. I just want to get try to get back in the habit of stuffing this a week ahead um just because it does help me when i can do this we will update i will update trackers later so yeah so for lunch money i'm going to give myself oh i wonder i think i wanted to roll no 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 we're gonna when i stuff it i forgot i'm not i'm just stuffing what we need so for lunch money we're gonna do 40 for groceries and this is not like a grocery trip right now um one day i would hope it to be but this is um if i just need like random things from the grocery store so we're gonna put a 20. we're actually doing pretty okay with groceries um because we just went um but gas is going to get 30 for a tank of gas so this binder's purpose is to, if I needed to pull from here, cause I give myself like um, some money each week, but this is like in case I run through it and this is kind of like the backup option for other like random expenses that do come up. Household needs. Uh, I need some like change. Maybe we can roll for this one. This one I don't mind it. Oh, well, I don't want to just do one. Let's, okay, okay, well, let's do five. I don't want it to just, uh, I want this one to build up over time. Babies, this is if they need like diapers. Mm, I think we will need wipes soon. Okay, spending, I'm not gonna put anything in spending because I have been spending a lot. George and Keiko, that is my cat and my dog. I'm just going to give them a 20. A lot of 20s. And family fun, we're just going to put a 20. Let me see what we put in here. 20, 20. <clears throat> we didn't do anything there. We gave babies 40. 
household needs we did five gas we did 30 groceries we did 20 20 we did 40 okay 175 in this that's actually a pretty good amount for a week ahead all right so now i wanted to get in two let's quickly go into sinking funds are we doing sinking funds no not this one sorry friends not this one but i did want to hop into this binder today so i'm like hitting everything and i i love this one I wanted to start these first couple envelopes for my car, but I did need to put 35 in here because my tag is, I think it's due, but right now we're just gonna put a whole 35 in. I think I need a hundred. Um, I need more change. Um, I would like to do everything, but let me get more change and I'll come back maybe. But I feel better about having that 35 in there. Um, and now we can start savings challenges. Oh, I don't know why I'm grabbing this one, friends. Okay, let me start with little bits. And we can probably grab, I think this one we can probably get some change out of. We'll see though. So here we're going to put $1. Looks like we're on purple for this week. Are we? I don't even know. That's not the same purple, but it's okay. <clears throat> but yes, friends, I'm really happy with our progress on this one. We are almost there. Okay, I'm gonna put a five in here. Let's see what we have in here. Five, 10, 15, 20, 5, 30. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and put all these fives. Wait, no. Let's keep two. We'll put the fives in here and we will grab a 20. We have a lot of 20s to work with today. Okay, yeah, we'll do that. Oh, wait, did we, but what did we add a five is the question? No. Okay, and then we'll put another five in to add two so we can color. All right. Oh, that's not the right color. I haven't done this one in a long time, it feels like, because I don't know anything about the colors. Oh, all right. Hope you guys are having a great day. I am having an okay day. We're gonna add a 10 into this 10 challenge. We have a lot of 10s in here. What do we have? 120, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. That's 60 right there. We're gonna get one, two, and three. Kind of condense along the way for the 10 challenge. Some sort of green, no idea. Okay, that's not it, but that's okay. Um, all right. And the last one here we're going to do is for the 20 spot. And we're going to add a 20 in. Look at all those 20s. One going to build up so fast. Just week by week. And these, um, if you guys are new here, um, these are placeholders. And this is representing money that is in my high yield savings account. And when I get to a certain amount or when it's just time for a bill exchange, I will... Um, Put that money in my savings account and then i will we'll put placeholders in to show how much we have for this challenge and i get my 
I have some of them linked in my description, but um, you can find placeholders. There's freebies in this wonderful community, and there's ones you can um, purchase. They're on Etsy and as digital downloads or physical. So there's a lot of different options out there. I made a couple. There's some in my Google Drive for free, guys, if you guys do need some. Um, I also have some on my Ko-Fi account. So yeah, friends, there are a lot of ways you can get freebies or uh, prop money. Um, let's see. This one we have already done for August, so we just need to do September, but I'm going to hold off on this one right now, and we might be able to do this next week. I just don't want to do it now because, um, it was uh, my turn to pay for daycare this week, so I don't want to get ahead of myself just yet. I might be able to do it next week. Um, I'm excited because all my bills are paid, and so I'm excited for next check. Okay, actually, I keep pulling this one out. Um, before we get into this one, I did want to get into our 100 envelope box before I forget. And let's pull out, oops. They're not in any order. This is um, a box by Hold My Money. It's a 100 envelope challenge. How I do it here is I uh, roll a d20 dice. If I can find it, here we go. I roll a d20, and that's what we stuff. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I grabbed perfectly 16 friends. Ooh, I want to do 16 so bad. We're going to do eight, though. Sometimes I do two, sometimes I do four. I've been doing eight lately, so I'm very excited. We'll see what we get, though. 15. We'll start off with putting 15 in. So yeah, I want to keep chucking away at this one because we're a little, we're almost halfway done with this one. So yeah, friends. But yeah, we're just stuffing whatever we roll. We'll get some high numbers today. 10, 15, 16, 17, 18. Guys, I ain't gonna lie to you. We might do, we might just do two. Or four. We might just do four envelopes. Oh, goodness, get in there. Three, one, two, and three. And we're going to do one more. I like to do a odd and or not odd, an even number of envelopes. Five. Oh, that's our last five. Yeah, we'll just do four envelopes. I was hoping we would get like a twenty, so I could put twenties. But that's okay, friends. And then I just have my little stitch guy in here that holds our place and then I shove him back in <laughs> okay that is our 100 envelope box by hold or not hold my money honey pot stash let's jump into this one really quick kind of a lot of hopping around today um and we are going to what's the next biggest we still have two 30s yeah let's do a 30 We'll do this shoe. This challenge is by um, Cute Meanie Things. And we're just going to throw this in here. And so now we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Wow, 75 friends. That's pretty good. I feel like we just started this one. And then let's put a 10 into this one to start these envelopes again we just unstuffed all of these on my um actually i ain't gonna lie to you friends i kind of want to double it let's double it and put a 20 here um so and then we could put a 10 here there we go so let's do each envelope double hopefully i remember that um i started our inbox 
unbox oh my gosh i cannot talk today i stuff this one on my last unstuffing so go check that out if you guys have not seen that one that was a lot of fun okay friends i don't know why i forget this every single time but we do have a little bit of rollover um in our wallet so let's go ahead and fix my chair um and so we have six dollars as a rollover so we will add that in okay so every little bit counts and then i did have some change i did want to dump to the change jar I knew I was forgetting something. Okay, so where were we at? I think now we're into our big book. Here. Let's go ahead and see what we got. All right. Um, first challenge up, I put it on the back here because I ran out of big envelopes. I'm going to push this to the side. I need to get Charmy Cat out so we can keep, I put that one in front because that is the last old, I say last old challenge that I have, kind of. Okay, here we go. All right, 5, 10, 15, 25. If we do 25, we could yeah let's do 25 and we'll finish out these keys because we need to we do need to move along on this one friends we have been doing this one for a minute and i'm tired of trying to find this paper but this one is made by me it is most of the challenges you see made by me they will be available in my ko-fi shop or my google drive friends I love this gold marker. It's so cute. All right. Last key. Okay. There we go. Okay. So then that's going to put, or let's, we're going to put 25 in. So we have 30 already. So it's going to be 40, 55, 55 in Charmy Cat. Okay, that is Charmy Cat. The next one we have here, um, it's my very first scratch out that I have made. I made this little cute Angelica one. It is poorly made as you can see, but I thought it was still so cute and I wanted to do it. Um, so it says I need a bag and it's so cute. Oh my god. And so I put the scratch off stickers on and then I made the back a roll and save. So yes, we are gonna start this one. Yeah, guys, it was me experimenting on making the scratch offs and how that would be and well friends, it's not hard, it's just I I only have like a basic laminator, so it is a little challenging. Let's just start here at the top. I don't know what I did. I think I don't know if I put an icon on here or not to like roll. Probably did because it has the plus sign. But this is a 24 plus. Yay! And we got a five. Alright. Oh, we don't have a one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Hopefully we can get changed in our next one. And that is going to start us off with our Angelica challenge. The next one we have here. This is by the Budget Princessa. 
and this is beets or beets it's super cute i don't know where we landed the last time because we were rolling but i think i want to um do this first one that is four dollars let's keep going Okay, that is two more dollars for six dollars. Well, let's try to get to 20 or something. There we go. This would be 10. Yeah, let's go ahead and stop there. I have a lot of new challenges so this is kind of my first run through with new challenges so I don't want to over put I want to make sure I want to try to get through the whole book okay so let's see that's ten dollars I have some change here though five ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen five six seven eight nine ten And then we can take these two tens back for the 20. There we go. So we got 46 in this challenge so far. And this is by the Budget Princessa, if I forgot to mention. Sorry if you can hear my babies in the background. They are crying. I made them bottles. And they just, they like drink them so fast. So I have to wait, like I wait so they can digest. Like they, <laughs> they need to digest. Okay, so the next one is this 50 envelope challenge by the Grammy, by Grammy Stings. And it's this little book here. We started off with an 11 on our first page. So we're gonna go to the second page and see what we got or what we are gonna get. I don't know the nomination. Oh, I do know. I think it's one through 25 twice for the 50 envelope so yeah ooh a 13 so we got 13 oh I wonder if we should be marking off on here I think we should be let's see let's do this pink so last time we got an 11 so I'll just highlight them if we did them. And then now we got a 13. Okay, yeah. Let's do another one. Ooh, a 14. to make sure that was 27 okay let's see if we can get to 40 let's do one more to even it out probably a mistake but let's just try oh my god <laughs> Seven eight. I wonder if I should be going in order like this since we'll be tracking it anyways That's a 17. I wonder if you guys want to see. Okay. There it is. 44. Let's put let's put 45 and put a one back. Let's see this. 20, 40, 5, 50, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Let's put this back for a 10. Alright, so 55 in this challenge. Oh, we forgot about the 17. Ooh, 
Yeah, so it's one through 25 and then um, again, again on the back. Okay, and that is by Grammy's Things on Etsy and she is Grammy's Journey on YouTube. She has some really cute Betty Boop challenges to friends. If you love Betty Boop, I got a couple from her. Okie dokie. The next one we have is my roll and save. Let's, I, we landed here, I guess, for the last time. Okay, let's keep rolling. So we got five. One, two, three, four, five. I didn't, I'll just use this as a marker. So we got four. Let's see if we can just keep it going. One, two, and three. Four plus six is ten. Let's leave it off there. And I'm going to take this little mark place off. And the next time we'll just keep going and start. I like to do the whole way around. And this last time we just did halfway. Because we probably were running out of money. And that's why I marked it. Okie dokie, so we have 20, 30, 45, 46, and 47 in this roll and save challenge. And then this one, I just and stuff it whenever I'm ready. And um, yeah, I just want to, probably when we get closer to finishing a lot of these new challenges, we'll unstuff that one. Yay! Okay, so the next one is a new challenge. Um, and it is over here. So this one um, is made by me. This one is my newest ad on my Ko-Fi shop. This is Disney versus Pixar. And basically we are going to do a like little bracket competition between what's like my personal favorite movies. So we'll see which one gets number one. It's going to be hard because I really love all these movies. So for each movie we are going to... How many should we do? How much money? I was gonna say five anyways okay five dollars each movie is five dollars um is that how I was doing it yeah okay so I'm gonna get a thinner marker though so we can write down so let's start here at the top so between Mulan oh this one is this leaking or something very weird um, so we're going to do Mulan versus Aladdin. And that one's a hard one, friends. But I would have to pick Mulan because I really, really love that movie. I love all the songs. I love the Aladdin songs too, but I I don't know. It's something, it's something about Mulan. And I really love Mulan too. So Mulan for the win. So that's $5. Let's do one down here oh wait so then we can go hercules versus encanto oh my gosh that's crazy i didn't pay attention to where i put things but oh or should we do one from pixar let's do one from pixar sorry so we got nemo versus monsters inc oh that's so hard monsters inc was my favorite when i was a kid i love nemo's like one of the best pixar films I'm gonna have to go Nemo even though this one was my favorite because Nemo has like Nemo um like Finding Dory like the continuation of that movie was amazing and it, the same with Monsters Inc though but I don't know friends I, I think I gotta go Nemo okay so we got Nemo basically we're gonna do um four of them so I'm gonna put a 20 um let's do another Disney one let's do one down here so we're gonna do let's do Tarzan versus the Lion King oh my goodness uh, I love Tarzan and I love the Lion King uh, I think for s songs it's Lion King but just like story and just I really really loved Lion King I mean Tarzan but I think we gotta go Lion King And we're gonna do one more over here. Let's do one down here. So we got Bugs Life or Toy Story. Ooh, 
I really love Bugs Life when I was little and I love Toy Story. But I think it's gonna have to be Toy Story because they, I love every single um, edition. Like every, like the second one is my favorite Toy Story. I love the third one and the fourth one and yeah, they just keep bringing it for me. So yes, it's going to be Toy Story. I do love Bugs Life. Okay, um, so that is $20 there, 5, 10, 15, 20. And yes, that is going to be this Disney Pixar. Let me know how you guys would have answered in the comments. Okay, let's put this $20 in here. Okay, the next one is going to be another new challenge. This one is also made by me and this one is one of my freebies. Um, in my 500 freebie thank you in my Google Drive. So yeah, we're going to do Mike Scare Final Countdown. And this is basically a play off of the calendar from Monsters University when he was crossing off until the final. Um, and yeah, I really loved that. I really loved the Monsters University movie. Um, we're going to get a red marker because that's what he was using. And... We're going to make each space, I was going to do a, I was going to roll a D6 for each space and for the events we're going to make it a times two. Um, you can make events $1, $2, $5, $10 extra, plus you can make the spaces, you can roll them, you can make each space $2, it's really up to you, that's why I like this challenge. Um, it, you can really make it your own way. So yeah, and I thought it was really, really cute. So we're gonna roll. So for the first day, we're gonna have to times whatever we roll by two. <gasps> Six dollars, I mean, twelve dollars for the first day. Okay, so that is twelve dollars. We don't have twelve dollars because we only have one five. We might have it in the ones, but let's try to, let's go again. And let's see if we can even it out. 15. And 15, because 12 plus 3 is 15. Let's do it again. 18. Can we get to 20? What did I say? 12. 15, this was 18, 19, 21, two, 22, $22. I'm debating on if I should write it down so I don't forget. I might write it down. So we got a six, then we got a so that was 12, then we got a 3 for 15, then we got another 3, and then we got a 4. Okay, yeah, that's how we're going to do this one, friends. Super cute! Okay, so that is the final countdown. The next one we have is another um, scratch off that I made. Look how cute! It's a melody, and this is a 30 plus. And on the back is another roll and save, so yeah super cute um let's roll and see where we're gonna go four one two three and four so we got two dollars let's go again one two three and four Again, for three dollars. Cute, so that's five. I will take that. Yay! All right, so the next one is another um challenge made by me this is one i wanted to start some halloween challenges and this is um my holiday scratch offs these are available on my ko-fi shop friends as a digital download and then if you guys have scratch off stickers you can add them yourself um let's start up here got 
13. Let's go again. <gasps> Yay! This one's probably my favorite one out of the holidays because of the cute ghost with the flowers. Okay, so that would be 20. It's really hard having all these 20s. All right, that's starting us off with that one. The next one is this Christmas tree challenge. It's so cute. Um, this one's by the Budget Princessa. Um, oh, you know what? I do want to start at the bottom. I don't know why I just rolled. Perfect, a 20. I did not know the denominations for this one, so looks like this one's going to be high. Okay, so that's our last 20. That kind of scares me. Um, we have one, oh no, we have two more. Okay, this one is um, our spooky um, cards from Spooky Budget. Um, I don't know remember if I shuffled them or not so we're just going to shuffle now these are um, my fairy tale cards so we're gonna do one let's see who we got we got Cinderella oh my god it's so cute and these are just um, scratch offs so let's see a nine We're just gonna pop that back in here. We might pop it on the opposite side. Let's see what we have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ah! <laughs> All right, well, that's what happens with that. Okay, and the last one we have is my Hello Kitty challenge. This one's by this and not by Esther. We only have a dollar left, so we're just gonna pop it here and just cross this one off. Um, and this one's kind of going to be like our catch-all. And if we have enough money at the end, then we'll, you know, try to cycle through these cards. But, yes. Super exciting. All right, friends. That is everything in our savings challenges today. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, friends.